everybody. Um, here I'm going to, on this video, I'm going to talk about court requirement for statistics 2023. Number one, uh, I will uh, request uh, to download your uh, standalone application uh, for Canvas on your phone. So if you go to your store on your phone, either phone, as long as it's smartphone, you have it and uh, search for Canvas and download it for free. And uh, then you want to go to settings of your phone, find a notification and release notification from uh, Canvas. Why I, I am asking to do that? Because when I uh, want to deliver you some information through announcement, all this information coming straight to your display and there is no way you will miss it. Number three, syllabus. Syllabus you have on uh, on your in your menu. It's under redirect tool. If you look down, uh, it's a home announcement assignment. Blah blah blah, and then it comes syllabus. You can open and read. Uh, there is no some extraordinary. It's a standard syllabus. The only thing I would talk a little bit later. It's about grades. Uh, textbook, it's very interesting and uh, I have good news for you guys. You don't need to buy any textbook. All information is um, uh, the, in, uh, on the, my video that I uh, created. You will, I'll talk about it in details. Uh, but you have to pay for access code. Oops, here should be, I'm sorry, one second. Let me get the white one and I clean this. There shouldn't be any comma. Okay. Access code to start crunch. That's all you need to pay for. And uh, it's going to cost you $10. Where is that crunch on uh, Canvas? So the, on the, uh, in the menu on the left side, that is in the column, it comes home. Uh, announcement, assignment, grades, files, and after that comes redirect tool. This redirect tool, since we don't have directly uh, CAD uh, StatCrunch installed, we're going to use this uh, tool redirect that will take us straight to uh, StatCrunch. Okay? It's going to ask you open in new tab, uh, this that crunch, it will open. And then uh, it will ask you to register for that crunch. Once you register, it will require, it will ask you to pay $10. Okay. All right. It's going to cost you $10. To paste that crunch that that those uh, that's the only expense you are going to have in this uh, course we don't have any textbook you're going to use my videos okay um grade book regarding grade book what we have um uh, graded in, in this uh, grade book so we're gonna have test ah oh, here we have Graded activity homework, that is going to be 20%. Quizzes are going to be 20%, not each, of course. In some, the whole quizzes are 20%. Entire homework altogether 20%. And tests are 60%, which since we have um, free tests, it's going to be uh, 20% each. Now, um we have also i place their final which is gonna be optional this is how it's gonna work if you are satisfied with your results you don't need to take final exam but if you wanna uh, improve any of your tests you take final exam and since we don't have any weight on final exam, this uh, result of final exam is going to replace uh, any test result you want. We understand? 
So the bottom line is we will have three tests and one will be final exam optional. If you are not happy with the result of any of these tests, you are going to uh, take final exam if you decide, it's up to you. You take final exam and result will replace one of these tests, whatever, whichever you will choose. All right. Now, homework is going to be unlimited. You can take as many times as you want. Quizzes are going to be unlimited. You can take as many times as you want. Test is going to be two attempts. Okay. And once you take a first attempt, if you have their mistake, it's going to mark down which ones are wrong. Uh, what is interesting, I would like to bring to your attention, home be it homework, be it quiz, be it, be it test. Since we are working in statistics course, uh, we're going to work uh, with uh, very small numbers, uh, with six digits, uh, decimal digits, with eight decimal digits, okay? Always when you are doing homework or quiz or test, always pay attention at the end in parentheses it says, round till 10th of uh, the decimals, round till 100, okay? So you need to round it. And if by uh, any chance, let's say, you have one or two or five uh, digits uh, difference, let's say um, your answer is uh, 2.73, but uh, the uh, given answer uh, you checked is uh, 2.75. Okay, this tiny difference, it could be uh, because of calculator or rounding or other stuff. So contact me right away, send me or text me you, because you will have my cell phone number, I will tell you later. You can text me and say that please uh, at the check and give possible credit for uh, this assignment, this problem. Okay, I'll go check. And uh, if I agree, most of the time I usually agree with students because uh, they send me the case where a couple of uh, decimal hundreds, let's say, are differ from each other. So I give them credit. You, you can do that to homework, to quiz, to test. Okay, um, that's it. Uh, next uh, video lectures, video homework and uh, quiz test video. So I will send you, you will find a video for on YouTube for my homework on the homepage. The link is placed in there. Video lectures, uh, it's a standard lecture. So if you are interested to see, you uh, can click and go see and watch it. But I think I have, uh, the, I lectured uh, based on homework, problem after problem well enough so that should be good enough for you but there are students want to listen lecture also be my guest okay um that's it uh, and the same way also i will have video for the quiz and test next formulas always always formulas and i would like uh, add calculators Okay, this is looks like too thick. Let me make it thinner. Calculator. So, below every single video, check for my comment, pinned comment, where I place the link to free calculator for this or that topic. And you can use that calculator, okay? Also, you can use StatCrunch for homework, for quiz, for test. It's very, very easy. In some cases, I explained in video. In some cases, you can go uh, every single work, how to work in StatCrunch. You can find in uh, modules, in the, uh, in the menu of uh, uh, the statistics course uh, on Canvas. Once you click modules, you will see Topics by chapter. Let's say for chapter two, where we explore graphs, you will find how to create histogram, how to do stem and leaf, and how to do simple bar plot, and so on. It's showing you easily how to do that. 
So my recommendation, I highly recommend, before you start uh, calculating by hand, go to that, let's say you are working on chapter three homework. Open chapter three in modules, chapter three, and see if this topic, uh, there, is there is explanation if you can cover the topic in StatCrunch. If it's there, just jump to do via StatCrunch. If it's not, then uh, you can uh, check if there, there is calculator under video, homework video, okay? So you have three options. One option that I highly recommend, right away, you know what topic is about, is this homework, jump to um, modules uh, menu and you will see the chapter according uh, accordingly you are working in and see if the topic, if the stat crunch covers that topic because you ha will have their description. If not, the other option you will have, check under the video on YouTube for calculator because I have written topic and then link to calculator. It's going to be easy because you will plug numbers in the calculator and get result. And the third topic is uh, take the formula from files and uh, use uh, based on formulas, calculate step by step. So three options, stat crunch, using stat crunch, that's uh, uh, the, the software stat crunch itself located in um, redirect tool. Um, uh, the the um, explanation of how to build, what to do. It's in uh, uh, modules, you will find it there, okay? And calculator under uh, videos. And uh, the videos you can find obviously on homepage under this video I will that I will place there also. Contact info, my contact info, you still gonna find it on uh, homepage. And again, please, please don't hesitate Contact me right away if you got answer that is very similar to your answer and uh, you, uh, demand credit. Okay, good luck to you and stay in touch. If you need any help with homework you or check the answer or anything else, text me, call me, email me. Okie dokie.